This is a, a defense that only got one and a half sacks per game coming into this. What, what were you seeing from them and they, the fact that they were able to kind of get to you guys? I mean, they switched some things up when it came to, you know, who, who they brought and what they did, and they were smart. And I mean, tor towards uh, after they did that, we, we kind of picked up on it. But from the beginning, uh, we didn't really. But towards the end, we really got it. So. It seemed to be a lot of miscommunications between Ross and the receivers. Is there anything talked about? Is there a common theme going on there? Yeah, I, I actually have no idea. I mean, offensive line, we just stick to what we got. And so that's really all we do is just focus on our jobs. How hard is communication along the line in a road game? Uh, up in the press box, we've got the windows closed, mm -hmm. so we can't hear how loud it is. Is it tough to communicate down there? Um, it really depends where you are. Over, over here, it really wasn't that bad. And we have hand signals for everything just in case. So the running backs, the offensive line can all communicate via hand signals if, if, they, don't, uh, if they can't hear. What were they doing differently than what you had seen them do? Uh, just football stuff, you know, just some X's and O's where they brought someone else than we thought. And, you know, we receive safety rotation. We think that they're going to stay in the box and they bring someone off the edge and move the linebacker out, little things like that. Um, smart by them. Uh, but like I said, we really, we really picked up on it towards the end. So it looked like their inside guys were attacking you guys. They're, no. they're, 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 in, they're inside linebackers too. Yeah, inside linebackers. They <clears throat> like to bring that Mike Will plug a lot. Uh, we picked up on it. That's not that's something we've seen since spring. So, so how many games the offense has gelled in the second half? Why do you think that didn't happen so much in this one? I mean, <clears throat> I, 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 I really can't answer that because it's all about rhythm and. Uh, you know, towards towards the end, we started picking up on our rhythm. We just have to be able to do that from the first half. We have to do that the whole game. We get in our rhythm because once we feel that rhythm, we feel unstoppable. So it's just a matter of being able to get in that rhythm sooner. We've seen you, know, you guys rally quite a bit this year. What do you expect on the flight home when you get back to the facility? When you guys get back to work? Back to work. You know, I mean, they say it's a twenty-four hour rule, but like after a loss, especially like this on the road. I mean, there's no 24-hour rule. Like, you have to forget about it immediately and focus right on the next game. So, you know, Oregon State's up next. That's who we're going to play. That's all our focus is on. This is in the past. So that's all we can do. Hey, guys.